at this point i already knew that i had been scammed my my people that was how i threw away sixty thousand naira welcome back to another video if today is your first time here thank you so 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 much for clicking to watch this video please do not make it your last one okay kindly hit the subscribe button so you get subscribed and join the family so you don't miss out on any other video that i get to post okay and i want to say a big welcome back to my amazing returning subscribers my returning viewers thank you all so 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 much okay now you're seeing this village villageois uniform uniform villageois yes you're seeing me here looking like a village girl you get why so this video is going to be um a basic to body makeup transformation yes but i must put a little disclaimer i am in no way a professional makeup artist see my makeup is just the pickup my makeup career just the pickup i see i only just do the barest minimum to be honest so i'm going to be transforming myself like you know from what you're seeing to what you're going to see so stay tuned if you want to see what you saw probably on the thumbnail okay um so since i've done the intro let me now go take this off i need to do my edges or try and do my edges i'll be right back so we are back now see today is my la the last day of the holiday so i want to make this video as snappy as possible i was supposed to do a story time but maybe in another video because <laughs> i think me that i'm a i'm an amateur makeup person I'm, i can't say i'm a makeup artist so we're going to try and make this as fast as possible let's get on with the video what's the first thing i usually do so i have to go watch the video to see so this is the look this makeup look right here that's what we're trying to recreate y'all asked for it now you're gonna have it you're gonna take it you're gonna receive it <laughs> so um i'm first going to you can see i'm sweating so i'm just going to wipe my face with this um even tone 3 one micellar water from nivea I'm just going to um, prep my brows I cannot find see all my makeup that I own fit into this bag okay except for this okay and my eyeshadow palette Sha. this was gifted to me by my girl at Saks Beauty kindly go support kindly go patronize that she sells um affordable slave products basically makeup nails weaves go check her out okay so i want these from her i've not tried out everything but i i use there's this one i always use it's not even here it's the nude color and sometimes this brown that's by the way so i'm like yeah let me show you that's this one so i decided that i'm going to say this story anyways i'm going to try and be brief so because see every time around this period i always remember this thing hmm. it's a story of how i was scammed <laughs> this will not be almost i was scammed in uni so 
if you're familiar with I, I don't know if I think that's how it is in every um government uh, in higher institution I mean I feel accommodation is always an issue so I need to give this backstory before I start let me just start as I was saying before let me digress I cannot find my what's it called brow gel and I see that some people use got to be I don't know whether this is the exact type they use but this is what I'm going to try and use it's just a teeny tiny bit Tosin, 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 tosin. Who sent you? Ah. So, accommodation is always um, an issue. I believe in every um government um higher institution every public university in nigeria and university of lagos my the school i went to was no exception so it so happened that when we got in during the is it orientation they call it where they will welcome us into the university, tell us about different areas of the university and things we should know and how to navigate through our period in the university. That time. So on one of I think on the second day or so then they told us about accommodation. That was when we got to the part where they tell us about accommodation and they assured us that a large percentage of us as fresh as would be allocated best spaces despite the fact that best spaces were limited so we were assured that given that we are new to the to the school system they did not want us to go through the stress of getting accommodation so they are showing us i think they said maybe about 80 percent or so that's a huge percentage of the freshers that would get best space if they apply so there was like a timetable there were on that day there was timetable for application so on the day that i think it was on that same day that they said oh yeah go at so so time and apply and you get your best basis it's going to be on the first come first start basis so we did that lucky for me and most of my friends we all got best spaces allocated to us right so we all got best places allocated to us. I remember they said it's only assured to us freshers, and then aside from being a fresher, the other people that we, the other categories that you can apply for accommodation through are uh, um, you can apply as a scholar. That's a a a a a a a a Yes, once your GPA or CGPA is above four point four point what four point five four point five and above you're going to get bed space like you apply and then if you're a sportsman if you're a helper before those that assist the um physically challenged students if you care for them so you get bed space um and also final year students then the other category that you can apply to is if you're not if you're not a fresher or if you don't belong in any of these categories that i just mentioned it's balloting and that's like go go <laughs> that's okay oh, the rest of you follow join here come and apply so that would be our case if we were not scholars after you won or sportsmen or whatever we would have to apply through the scholar category we would have to apply through the what's it called ballot category rather you guys my brush is dirty and i even need new brushes i need new brushes but since i don't do makeup that often that's why i've not bought my foundation if i tell you that my foundation is the two foundations that i have they are at least two years old <laughs> believe me my powder you can tell this is for sure going to be like three years old see this is over three years old. I've been using it. 
I have the wear makeup. So, and these days, thanks to YouTube, that's where, why I get to do makeup. Other than that, it would be if I was going out. And I don't go out much. So, so most of us, most of the people that I knew and myself, we all got best places in year one. Fast forward to year two now. Towards the end of year one, I was like, ah, I was already scared. Like, ah, how will we do this best place? So I live far away. My parents' house was in um, Open State. I was schooling here in Lagos State. I will go do. I don't get family member where I can stay with another. I was already thinking ahead. So, man, we we're just looking out for. So, it will be towards the end of the yeah, second semester. That's when they're going to start opening up the portal for um, hostel application. So, by the end of year one, you already, I think, was that it? Yes. So, by the end of year one, you already know your fate. You already know if you got best space. Yes, I think that was it because we we balloted we balloted when I we were in the hostel already in year, year one hostel yeah so as I was saying I'm at you I don't forget so apply this yeah it's really dirty Cover your eye pencils, cover your lip pencils, and no go here. See. So, when we balloted towards the end of year one, I did not get. <laughs> hey, then that's when it struck that one more. I'm about to not experience the real Unilab. I was already scared. Hey, I will do. I was so sad. Myself and every other person that didn't get we were so sad. I especially things I get I worry a lot. That's one that bad thing about me. I worry a lot. So I was already thinking, how would I do trying to talk to people? I beg if you know someone, if you know someone that can get for oh so something. Do you know anyone? Because na Nigeria with the with the right connection, you all, things will always work out no matter what. So I started to ask people because it's left to me, I don't know anybody. So I was asking, oh, do you know anybody? Do, 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 do. I didn't know anybody. <laughs> yeah. Then I didn't moisturize. We will do them like that. I can't moisturize after this one now. So pardon me, fellow beginners, before applying this. You're supposed to um, moisturize your face. I forgot that. We're going to bring it. So, this is one of the foundations I said I've had for the longest time. Milani. I have Milani and Maybelline. Okay, and Maybelline. For some weird reasons, I like to feel like the pros are mixed, like I know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. But I think I like the Maybelline better. I don't even remember which one I enjoy. Usually, this is enough for me. But for the sake of this video, let's pretend that I put a lot of foundation on. So this is fine. Okay. I think... This one has a more of a reddish on that tone than the other one. I need some my hand. So, as I was saying, we didn't get hostel. Most of us did not get. Very few people got that I knew of on my floor, on my wing in the hostel. Yeah. Come together. It's now waiting at the east. <laughs> it will come together. So we didn't get. So we left. We all left. Most of us left the hostel at the end of the session, not knowing what we were going to do. 
regarding our hostel accommodation as is i did not know what i was going to do i almost don't want to leave like hey i'm moving out like this where i go moving to the next session i don't know so that uncertainty was was killing me like ooh, you know this so we went for the holiday during the holiday that this was the area era of bbm right so during the holiday now i would later go on my holiday and uh, i got added to this group on bbm it was called lag peeps lag peeps So on that group, I met different people. Most I met guys. They were only guys that I met. I mean, that added me from there. So we'd go on and then chat. Long story short, it was on that group that I met a certain guy that hooked me up later on. So it so happened that during the holiday i was still trying to be in touch i was trying to be in touch with fellow students asking them what they were doing about the hostel accommodation mostly it's the ladies that stress over hostels you find both male hostels and female accommodation as well were not we are available in limited amounts but you would most likely find a girl hosting to get hostel than you will find a boy because guys easy life 10 guys can be in a room meant for four people and they will live just fine but us girls we love our space you know so it so happened that i was trying to keep in touch trying to make sure that information does not pass me by if they open the portal again i wanted to be aware of it and all of that so i would keep on asking and whenever I chat with anybody, if they had any news about accommodation, that's how this guy. So we had, had we resumed then, we were close to resuming for the new section, new, um, for the new session that was, I was going to resume yet too. So this guy that would now become my friend. So. One more. It just occurred to me now that my setting spray is almost finished. I need new makeup, you guys. Who go buy me makeup? Who go buy me new makeup? Buy it. <laughs> okay, so what was I saying? So this guy now, when we resumed, don't on me that hey, so now like this, I want to do the fly from Ogun State Otter to Yaba every day. I have lectures, no, so that's how I chat. This particular guy said, Oh, you know, would ask me after we had resumed, I was still hustling, no bed space, whatever. So, this guy now, on one of these days, we were chatting, and he was like, So, how far your hostel? And now he told me he had gotten, he was trying to clear his bed space, guys. Now they will get. They opened the hostel portal again or something for the guys because they had best space available. So he got, he was going to clear it. I was just there asking him, oh, so how far you have, have you cleared? Da, 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 da. Then he went ahead and asked me on one of these chats that about my own hostel. I said, ah, I've still not seen no. Please, if you hear anything, let me know. That's how later on, some Mausha came and told me, oh, you know someone who that someone that has helped his friend i say hey, are you sure he has done it for his friend he say yes oh the person has already got his best they say yes what best they say he knew all he doesn't know exactly but he, the, the lady got best space in new all. i said fine cool i was in new all the previous session so i would not mind new all let me have the contact of this person So he gave me the contact of this person 
that helps his friend. He gave me the contact. I reached out to the person and then we, I think we had resumed the new session around December or something like that. Sha. I chatted with the person, the person asked me well, what hostel in New Orleans do you want? Ha, see me in excitement because I was in fact one at the previous session and we used to always admire MTH. MTH good cleaner. So I was like, ah, MTH, I want MTH. I've had a taste of I've had a taste of um, Fagunwa oil, so I would want MTH. I mean Fagunwa oil was not bad, but we that were staying in Fagunwa, we felt like MTH was cooler. So I said MTH. It's alright. Let's meet at so 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 at on so 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 day. On so and so day. So we met. I love doing this. So we met now. We met where? Around that 40 oil, that 40 um, fueling station opposite Ac Access Bank, then. Is it Access Bank? So it's opposite Intercontinental Bank. I think it's now Access Bank that is there. Whatever. So I didn't even remember when they changed to Access Bank. This one I'm saying it was formerly Intercontinental, but it was Intercontinental when we got into the school. So We met by that filling station. He drove his car there. I met him, entered the car. He had asked me questions about hostel I the space I um, the hostel I wanted. So by the time I met him, he just gave me he gave me like that form, that hostel form that would usually fill out when registering for hostel. Just it looks exactly like what I had filled in the previous session when I was registering for my hostel there. I feel it out, and you know that form comes if you went to you know like you know how the form comes it comes in trees it's a trip triplet form i don't know what they call it then so if the form comes in threes that you feel you feel it in three different places then they'll divide them one for you one for the hostel and one i don't know where the other one goes to so he had that he had that form and he gave me to feel i filled it so excited like whoa this was like the weekend, few days before Christmas. <laughs> so this was how I I filled it. I collected. I filled it. Then he told me, okay, it's going to go do all the processing. Then I would get my own the form that would be mine. I would get it after the Christmas break when the school resumes after the public holiday. I was like, okay, thank you. Right there and then I gave him cash. Hostel space, I think that time was no more than 30k or 32k. I think it was about 32,000 or 20 something thousand. I do not remember exactly. But given that na parole levels, na na, it was 60k. The guy said 60k. Oh, 60k, oh, fine. Oh, wow, that's cool. I know people that, I used to hear people that have paid. I heard of people that paid 80k and the rest 70 something k to get a best space in New York. So I'm like, fine. I paid, told my dad, he gave me the money. I met up with this guy. I filled the form and I gave him 60,000 Naira in cash. Few days to Christmas day. How naive. I thought you don't get naive than that. You don't get any naive than that. <laughs> That's why I paid him more. I'm not even showing you things like I'm using new band concealer that I've gotten since. I've been using this since maybe 2017. No, no, no. 2018. This one too should be at least two years old. I mean, I bought this when I was still living by myself before I got married. Long before I got married, so. And I will soon be one year married. Okay, so I paid him, went home, 
I was already and spitting. By the way, on the day that I paid him, I, while I was going home, I stopped by a friend's place. And I remember, ah, just just seeing my mama, hostel, Okiniko, and I told him why I went to school that day. He said, so, how does it work? And I nice explained, he said, oh, so you paid him? I said, yes. You gave somebody 60k some days to uh, Christmas? I said, yes, now it's my friend. I said, yes done it for somebody that he knows my friend gave me the contact say hey, ah i wish you good luck oh you trust people like that he said he doesn't trust anybody with, with money except for one person that he said he doesn't trust people like that too with money and he wished me good luck you know it was not until then that i started to fear like i was now scared of, hey god don't let it be a scam and i reach out on my way home i was just praying god don't let it be a scam God, please don't let me regret this. God, please let them not scam me. Fast forward to when we resumed school. By the way, more about the makeup. I tried to imitate most of what the beauty gurus do, but with my minimal makeup products, like my basic makeup product. Like you see, I um I lighted. I would just usually I like this and just put a tiny bit here because I think it makes a difference. I'm just slapping on foundation and whatever. So I just try to imitate imitate what the makeup gurus do. I like it, I like it, and I'm going to do this one too. And maybe yeah. So I'm going to be letting this to sit first, then I'm going to set it for later on. I think that's how somebody said it. So fast forward to when we resumed and mind you before i paid that money a very a friend right we stayed in the same hostel just, let me say a friend she squatted with my bunk mate so she was so nice as to offering a best space like offering me a space to squat so she said oh i got space person come how can you do this come come stay with me i'm like okay thank you i'm going to stay with you but i'm still trying to get my own space i said all right i'm good so i, I stayed with her just i stayed with her the weekend before i even went to pay that money the week before i went to pay that money so when i resumed in the new when i resumed after when I resumed after the public holiday, I stayed at her, I squatted with her. I squatted with her. Now the problem is with, you know, not using exactly what the beauty gurus uses. You know, there are specific brushes and specific, specific sponges for some kinds of precision like this one that i did now you see this brush is too big this sponge is too big and it has just spread it beyond where i want to have it but it is what it is okay back to my story we resumed by the time we would resume and we're squatting i was this i was i resumed squatting with this girl i was still trying to you know meet up i was going to class and then i remember the day he said i was going to hear from him was a wednesday we had lectures that day and I, I was so busy. I think I was done with lectures at, at around past six. So after lectures, I went to New Hall to the cafeteria to just grab a quick dinner before I headed back to the hostel where I was squatting. By the time I would get there, I said, wait, I never hear from this person. No. Then I called. Mind you, I'd been calling during the day like when we would be on break i was trying the number it was not available then i tried after the lectures i now tried calling again it's the number you've dialed is currently not available please try again later thank you my heart started to pound immediately i reached out to the guy who gave me the contact i'm like guy 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 this person's phone is not connecting what's the lost? and he said i was going to hear from him maybe today i mean yesterday i can't remember and what did this guy tell me this friend of mine was like ah that's true even them too they've been trying to reach the guy the guy has not been his number has not been reachable 
dead, he had an accident, blah, blah, blah. Ah, I said, ah, I hope it's not that this person has said, ah, no, no, they said he had an accident. He but they are trying to reach him that he will be back, he will, he will be okay soon. That did not sit down well with me. It didn't sit well with me at all. I, went, I remember going back to the hostel like with fear, in fear. I was so scared and I was just praying like, God, I hope I've not been scammed. One week later, we are still trying to reach this guy. And I would call this friend who gave me the number. How far? This, this, and at this point, the person that was spotting me was was trying to reach this guy alpha alpha by the t- later nine let's face the makeup we'll get back to the story so i have this um powder that i bought for 150 naira by the roadside in the that's what i usually use to set my concealer but i don't know where that is the last time i did makeup this was what i used this cousin's baby powder. I got this one because of it. Back then when I was in the drill, like, with the get light issue with it. I would now be feeling irritated, so I will use this before I go to bed. So this is what I'm gonna use to set up, to set my foundation. So I'll just pour it here. I cannot find my powder brush. That's because my makeup bag can't take everything, so like I can't put everything in one place. So we improvise again. And I do this, see, reverse control. Davis eye pencil. Now I'm not even sure which one I love. I think this darker one is one I like, so I like to use the two. Since I have the two shade in between. My own brows does not take an eternity. So call the guy that gave me his contacts to to ask have you been able to reach him i am yet to be able to reach him like since the day i was supposed to meet with him and get my hostel pass that was the day that his number was became unreachable for me so i would just randomly call the number it would not connect still hmm. at this point i already knew that i had been scammed So, I would call this person that gave me his contact and meet with him. So, I met with him at some point in New Old one evening after lectures, still asking for updates. So, they said he has, so how, how is he now? Has he recuperated from the accident? What kind of accident? Has anybody seen him? Why, why are you also looking for him? Guess why this person was also looking for him? 
according to this person now that i am always looking for him because the person has defaulted he said that this person let's call him jay jay was the one that connected me with k so jay now says he's also looking for this person like his friend his so-called friend that he claimed had gotten hostel through k what happened why is your friend looking for k he said because um the hostel the the he has not gotten the hostel for his friend k yeah i'm like but you told me that he has done it for your friend say yeah yes he was doing this for his friend i said hmm, I, I would not have worked i wouldn't have worked with that you told me he had done it for your friend that she had gotten an host a hostel in new all that was what you told me if i knew that they were still doing it for your friend i would have waited for your friend to at least get her home before i, I gave it a try come on my 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 people that was how i threw away sixty thousand naira now this guy was i said hey that means he has he has scattered away with my money now then this person jay was like oh no no we are going to find him my friend has reported him to some big boys on campus big <laughs> what You say <laughs> big boys. I was like, eh, big boys. Ah. Man, no deal. You say, I know it doesn't. Yeah, it doesn't involve. You don't need to be involved. That but it's going to. They are going to fetch him out because of this is friend. This girl, a friend of his that did not get her bed space. Hey, now I give my mouth this. I'm saying, eh, tell you alone. What to Jay? let it go I, I told i said before when the matter done the rich matter of some big boys who i be who be me who she be i was like count me out and that was the last time i inquired about the guy or my money or the so-called friend that didn't get a space that was the last time i even um reached out to that guy i mean he would randomly chat me up later on at some point in the at some point after that we would just be to greet each other did he even chat me up no or maybe just exchange pleasantries if anybody any one of us updated something on bbm that was it hey my brothers and sisters that was how i was calm though one feet take home like that was how the warning of that friend of mine became true like who does that went and gave somebody sixty thousand just some few days to christmas right so that was how they scammed me oh in year two because of best space and of course there's nobody you can report to i don't know i don't know the like there was no way of getting this guy because i only met him once i did not even recognize his face i only met him for a few minutes feel that from the i didn't look at his face then i just knew i think the car was wine or red or something like i want small car finish So that was how I let it go. That was how I let it go, you guys. <laughs> that was it. Year two. That was how the first scam me before I eventually I eventually got a bed space. That was like over a month after. Like I was still squatting. Even I had issues with the person I was squatting with. It was just a whole mess. 
but then again to the glory of god i got my own best space i located to me directly from the school authorities like so let me wipe this out i totally forgot i'm supposed to wipe out wipe off this i'm not setting it for too long but i already did i know my face is looking very whitish we're going to do something about that stage they got it in year three everybody experienced that hostel asshole see you don't know you don't know if you asked me what was the most difficult part of my um university days it would be hostel see i i <clears throat> i went through it i went through it in year two i went through it in year three year four and year one were the only times that i did not i did not stress year four was even year four i would have even gone through it too so it's thanks to a friend who helped me to apply from where it was where there was faster network like it was crazy it was a mad thing mad mad <laughs> so i got that was how i got served with my guys that was how i got scammed i got scammed that was how i got scammed so if you went to university of lagos if you experienced hostel palavers let me know in the comment section sign in yes let's do it an akokite check-in <laughs> in the comment section like, I mean, just as to the fact that this is our Nigeria, eh? some yeah, 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 where you're not supposed to even they bother about. Now, you go the waste prayer point. God, please, new session won't start like that. We pray, everybody in my house, we pray. Oluwa, Jackie, or more, or more, real still, but Oluwa, Jackie, or more, real still, but God, God, and the thing was. I didn't quite I didn't like the idea of getting an hostel outside school. Even if I did, it was pretty expensive. Like because I would not want to go and be staying in some crooked areas. So hostel was my best option. The main, the, the the main star of the show, my the eye shadow. Now I do not remember the exact colors, like maybe what I used for the transition. But we are going to try and make it work. I'm going to use this and this as my transition colors. This is the brush I'm just using. I've had this brush since since I can't remember. Like before NYSC. That's how long I've had this. And I served in 2016. So do the math. And it seems this one is more pigmented than this one so i'm going to try and dust it off i think it's more better this way see all the amateur things <laughs> so now where is the pink color i'm now going in with this pink 
here okay this is not the pink i need so let us go ahead that is definitely not the pink i used but it's so cute it's so pretty i didn't know that anybody would come and ask me to recreate this i probably would have kept took i would, I would have taken note of the colors that i used like the exact colors but we'll make this work what it will do uh, Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just do some I think I want to do a little bit of smoky eye. So I'm not going to use this dark this dark green color here. So that is it. And now I'm going to use my finger. This was what I used. I think I used this color here. Yeah. Kind of pinkish and purplish at the same time. Then slap it on. No. I didn't just slap it on. Let's see. I think I, I did a cut crease. But let's see if this works. So I'm now going to just slightly spread it. So I've gone and it to try and fluff it out. But I realized that I think what's missing is this so i'm now mixing this and these shimmery colors to form that shimmery effect that i had here yeah this is the look guys this is it So, so I'm prepping my lashes for so while I do that. Let's let's do the lips. So I have on yet nude lips, which has become my go-to lip combo. Well, not lip combo, but like that's just what I would typically go for on the lips, nude. Before I used to go for bold colors bold ombre colors purple pink but now i don't know so i think i used brown on the so i'm going in first with my brown lip pencil you don't want your lips to be too moisturized or too glossy
this one is darker. So now back to my face, guys. I hope you're not expecting too much from me because I'm so sorry. This one I can't find my since I cannot find my powder brush for my contour yes i do my own caricature i do my own caricature contouring and i use this zaron palette this was gifted to me by a colleague at work my boss one of my bosses years ago I should have done these things but because I'm talking and doing everything at the same time I just missed the order of how I would usually do it so this is my little this is my little nose contouring Like I said earlier, you will not get the same results as far as you're not using the exact same tools that you also have used. That is not all. I'm also going to contour my cheek area. 
what I usually do, I used to use my powder brush. I would just do like this. I know if a professional makeup artist is watching this, he or she will just be cringing. But please, please, this is how I do it. And at least it looks good enough for what I need it. This is the final look guys, see, tell me this was not a professional fit, eh, look at, like, look at, and then the rosiness on the cheeks just took it to another level, like, I don't know, I, I forgot, usually I would apply the powder blush right on top of my foundation before I powder it up, I imagine, I've not even done applied powder, but I went ahead, I went ahead and um, and did what? I can't remember what I wanted to say. I can't remember what I wanted to say, but like this is the finished look. After so many minutes of struggling with the lashes, this one's still not sitting well, but like it's gonna work for this video. That is how, guys, this is how I do my makeup for and then. Some people even compliment it and say they thought I usually get my makeup done by a makeup artist for my videos. I'm like, really? Really? Does it look that good? So this is how I do it. And I love it. Like, simple stuff. Baby powder. Regular products. And your face is beat. It's beat to the heavens not to the gods this beat like <laughs> i love it i wish i was going somewhere and i'm not going anywhere unfortunately and you guys who else is feeling this color mix right here like i am obsessed i need to do a wig with this exact color combination because it's so unfortunate that I will have to take down this hair in a couple of weeks time like let me know in the comment section if you're feeling this makeup most especially if you're feeling this hair right here like let me know you know gas me up in the comment section you guys let me know are you feeling this look are you feeling the girl are you feeling the air which one is it for you so guys that's it for this video how I got scam story time how I do my makeup that's it for this entire video I hope you did enjoy spending time with me I envisage that this is a long one already like this video is long and I want to hope that and I hope that you enjoyed it actually you took something away from it let me know what you did learn from it and please if you're yet to subscribe kindly hit the subscribe button please oh join the family <laughs> okay kindly hit the subscribe button join the gang thank you for watching and i'll catch you on my very next one bye